This summer, you can certainly uh, take a nice walk without the worry of scorching temperatures if you know where to go. Yeah, so the Bonsai Car Wellness Arena, uh -huh. that's where to go. It opens its doors so you can stroll, so you can stroll along the concourse. Fox Carolina's Joe Gagnon is live from the well this morning. Joe's done a lot of walking this morning, and he's kind of letting us know how we can yeah. take advantage too. Joe. That's right. Now I'm going to, because I did so much walking, it's now time to talk about ice cream and donuts. Um, just kidding. Heather Carden's with us, a physical therapist from Montsecourt St. Francis. And um, you did not bring the ice cream and donuts for me to eat. Is that right? I did not, unfortunately, <laughs> although they do look very good. They do look very good, but it, it kind of indicates how much exercise you have to do if you eat these items, doesn't it? Exactly. So oh. if you think in real life situations, mm -hmm. um, walking one mile for an average person of about 155 pounds, um, walking three point five miles per hour, they're going to burn about 80 calories a mile. Okay. 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 So which is four laps at the well, because each lap is about a quarter of a mile. Okay. Perfect. So if you look at this bowl of ice cream, standard bowl, nothing fancy, no huge bowl, you're looking at a 320 calories. So you got to walk four miles to burn that off. For two scoops of ice cream? Exactly. Oh, no. So that's 8,000 steps or 16 laps at the well. Okay. And how about donuts? Is that so a superfood? So the donut food? is a little, it's not a superfood. It is a little bit better. Uh -huh. um, it's about 194 calories. Okay. So you're looking at only having to take 5,000 steps um, or nine laps at the well. That's a lot. Okay, how about watermelon? Watermelon, obviously, this time of year is going to be your best option. Okay. Better choice. You're only going to have to walk about one mile because it's 90 calories, so a little over one mile, but um, 2,000 steps or about 4.5 laps. And that is a lot of watermelon compared to that little donut. It is. Or the ice cream. I mean, volume-wise. And this is great for hydration, too. Right. Good for hydration and um, post-exercise, of course. So if I have the donuts and the ice cream together, I'm never leaving. You, you aren't. Or hmm. the rest of the other 11 donuts you would need to stay all day yeah what if you ate a dozen donuts yourself <laughs> it would be not very good oh situation. my gosh <laughs> so yeah uh, make sure you cut down on your donut and ice cream intake unless you plan on walking for eternity back to you <laughs> stick to watermelon yeah or what if we dip the donut in the ice cream just a thought <laughs> then we keep walking we yeah. keep walking joe uh, thanks so much Margaret right now has got some headlines yeah. for us